Hello Virgo. Ta-da. How are you all doing? How have you found June? It has been um, intense. That full moon was incredible. Incredible. Um, that is bringing around all the change. It's bringing around truth. So if you're not prepared for the truth to come out, you will not have enjoyed <laughs> the full moon in Sagittarius because that was truth bombs all over the place wasn't it let's be honest i feel like these are all yours so i'm gonna go with it wow okie dokie what's going on here virgo very interesting Alrighty. um yeah so yeah <laughs> that four million sagittarius was intense that had like everything 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 going on you've got some real interesting cards here especially that this is over the tower that's very interesting placement okay okay got justice you've got some big cards right no this there's too many there i need to we need to get clarity on this <laughs> So last three cards for Virgo, please. Why did my book feel weird? Anyway, sorry, last three cards for Virgo, please. Last three, come on, you can do it. Let's do it this way. Not looking. One, two, so that strength card was definitely supposed to come out. Some of these cards are definitely repeating across here, okay. I'm going to turn these around. Okie dokie Virgo. I've got some real interesting energies here actually. This very much, I feel quite empowered. Like I want to stand up straight. Like when I, when I look at this and read this, despite the fact we've got a few hiccups, generally I feel very empowered with this energy. We've got the three of cups here. Okay, now again, cups is normally to do with um, emotion. Um, and things like that but what I feel really positive about is I almost feel like this is a time of harvest emotionally for you okay this is a time for receiving like reaping what you sow okay so I feel like you've been working really hard you've really been putting in the effort and you're going to start seeing the benefits and the reward to the work that you have put in okay this is a really nice card it feels very positive um now we have the nine of cups in uh nine of pentacles in reverse here okay this for me feels like um we've got a lot of hope you know we have the pentacles growing around you here so again a bit of reaping what you sow but what i'm really drawn to as well is the bird here for hope and then we have the tower um which is why i find it so interesting we'll have the ta <laughs> the tower card underneath but we have the tower here and it's almost like you're sending messages to someone but i, al I almost feel like you're telepathically sending them and then there's all this stuff that you want to say and communicate to this person and you're almost uh, like i feel really like i'm sending birds um to send these messages you know how like hogwarts style <laughs> so i feel like there's not physical communication you know not like a text email um physical like uh why are my words not happening see no communication i'm trying to say mouth communication but that's not accurate but you know what i mean but this is all this is all not coming out right because there is a lack of communication you are not speaking you are not saying what you need to say about to this person okay now this could be a few things for a few of you this could be romantically speaking there could be someone that you fancy i feel like it's more that you like someone um and on the flip side as well it could be maybe like a family friend something like that where um you're not speaking your mind at the moment you're just expecting them to know why there is a distance between you and that they should know what they did wrong they should know their mistake um but you're not communicating it so they can't learn grow you can't fix that relationship if you haven't communicated what the problem is you need to have clear communication here virgo okay now so some of you it will be that and some of you it will be that you're kind of admiring someone from afar and expecting them to notice you but you need to speak up and say it okay now this card for me feels 
linked more to the family friend lack of communication side of the nine of uh, nine of um, pentacles here because we've got this little bit of conflict i feel like we're, we're at odds with someone at the moment again i feel like you feel um they've done something they don't know what they've done they feel like everything's gone a bit weird there's all just this big lack of of communication and so you keep butting heads over silly things like i don't know maybe there's something you've posted on social media and they assume it's about them because they don't know what they've done so there's like this butting of heads it's not full-on conflict but there is a bit of a standoff occurring you're not making any progress because you're not talking about the situation okay now this could be endings or reconciliation here okay we've got the ten of cups now the first thing i notice here is almost like and this is why i say it's two because of course there are more than one group of virgos so this is why it can split both ways um if you're picking up on more obviously than one type of virgo which hopefully you know that is my job <laughs> um so some of you virgos this will be to do with endings um of a relationship and for others this is more about reconciliation okay so either when i say endings of a relationship if you're in a relationship and it's ending or if you haven't communicated still to this person you fancy so maybe there's like an unrequited love situation occurring there's some kind of miscommunication but for the rest of you i do feel like this is a reconciliation this is a um this feels like apologies you know we've got um the cups here all the emotions that have been spilled out we've got all the cups here all the emotions that have been spilled out but then we've got this beautiful rainbow above you both okay which is why i feel there's a reconciliation going on here i feel like you're finally you will have spoken you'll have talked it through and now you're going to be coming out the other side of it okay so remember there are two groups that i am talking about here okay um i do just need to shut that door because it is raining hard come on this way this way no okay That is a big storm coming and I wish I'd bought the washing in yesterday. But I got distracted, I had loads to do and it didn't happen. And now, it probably never will. <laughs> um, so moving forward here, we've got the, we've got another, we've got a lot of eights and nines. Energetically, I have a couple of fives actually, which is kind of that in between. Anyway, uh, nine of swords. This is about... This feels like you're bound to a situation, okay? Um, you're almost bound to your baggage, to some extent. I feel like you're you're in your own head again. Swords are very very much about like the mental side of things, you know, how you think, action, that kind of thing. And there's no action being taken here. You're just kind of sat blindfolded, almost like. <laughs> I feel like I said this to one of the other signs, almost going like, la la la, I can't hear you. If I can't see it, it doesn't exist. And you're like ignoring your problems right now, um, Virgo. You're ignoring, you're ignoring your thoughts. You're ignoring your feelings. You're like pretending they don't exist. Again, it could come back to this where you're not communicating. I am so sorry. <laughs> if any of you are cross watching and have like watched your own star sign and are now watching your love interest is star sign person of interest or maybe you have like your sun moon um venus etc in in virgo you will know that i'm just not having a good day for recording these videos i'm having to do it like a thousand times um so yeah yourself you're constraining yourself with your own thoughts no one has put you in this this position except for yourself okay now leading forward to that we have the tower this is everything is going to change everything is going to upheave and you are going to have to really really look at how you're moving forward okay um i feel like this is basically saying you can't stay stuck anymore you can't stay in this safe zone you have to change you have to move forward you either have to let something go you have to step into something there is there is inevitable change coming your way virgo okay now this is very interesting we have scorpio energy here okay we have a hundred percent scorpio energy here they can uh, they can be very sneaky okay um now again i find it very interesting we're in this line here so 
this kind of non this standoff battle i feel like if you don't get around to actually communicating like i've said um and you stay at this standstill rather than um fixing the situation there may be underhanded ways in which this situation gets handled or dealt with if you do not deal with it first again we have this tower moment but what i find fascinating is we have the queen of wands here okay so i feel like even if there is an underhanded situation going on even if things are not going <laughs> as you expected them to um this is about staying true to yourself standing in your power owning who you are and not letting your peace be disturbed by someone trying to sting you okay because i feel like there could be a potential for a bit of backstabbing going on here okay virgo i hate to say it but that is how i feel but you need to not rise to it you need to stay in your power you need to stay true to you and you need to not rise to this person's underhanded tactics okay justice will prevail okay the balance will be reset this is all about justice truth will out okay so stay true to you don't get involved because the truth will come to light regardless that truth is coming out so just yeah there's again a lot of strength here okay this is about being strong staying true to you having strength having strength as well in this tower moment and in this need to communicate okay fruition is coming your way but you have to allow it you can't keep blocking it so much um again we have this card reverse this has come up reverse a couple of times today um i feel a little bit similar um as to another another one of the star signs but the only difference for me is that again it's linking to this um oh funny enough it's in that line isn't it it's linking to this backstabbing so you might not be able to see it might be invisible you might not be able to see what's going on but just keep oblivious keep doing you keep pouring water into your own well filling your own cup up look at all these shooting stars here for you for this change these beautiful new beginnings don't allow this influence to get in your way okay because <laughs> lightning will strike <laughs> okay lightning will strike the the justice of this situation will come to light um why is it being such hard work okay justice will come to this situation um and you can stand back from afar and know that this will reach the situation the you know the ending beginning whatever that it needs to reach will happen um you just stay in your power you make amends where needed you stay in your power stay out of other people's situations stay out of that person trying to sting you and stab you in the back keep doing you and you can weather your own storm because well to be fair that storm isn't even coming anywhere near you if you can stay in your own power stay out of the situation you're going to be well away from that storm when it hits okay so I feel like this is about keeping to yourself a little bit, Virgo. Take a step back. Don't feel the need to get involved in other people's drama um, at the end of this month, okay? Stay out of people's drama. They don't need any help. They're creating a nice enough mess all by themselves, okay? <laughs> truth be told, the truth will out. That's what I said here with justice, okay? Truth be told, that truth is a coming. So yeah, just, just... <laughs> this was the card that was about to fall out and I stopped it but I shouldn't have because it's peace again green all that peace all that joy all that staying in your own line stay in your lane stay in your energy okay, one more one more card for Virgo one more card for Virgo please and thank you whoa i said one more card not a hundred thank you very much <laughs> i feel like it's you Look, we've got a lot of green here we've got a lot of healing so again i do feel this is relevant we've got be flexible uh not be flexible flexible um and i feel that this is just about your approach okay yeah. don't feel the need to 
if you need to go a different direction to step out of someone's way do it you know be like a movable tree in the wind okay if it's rigid it will snap if it moves with the breeze it will get to where it needs to be okay um so just be flexible in your approach remain peaceful in yourself and the truth will come out about this situation but you also need to speak your truth okay there are a few layers to that um so i hope that this resonated it helped in some way um and yeah made sense um please do like share subscribe it means the absolute world to me please you know comment get in touch um if you do want a private reading the details will be in the description box below um in the meantime take care lots of love stay true to you truth will out okay take care speak to you soon